Okay, take two. Hello, everybody. It's Connor and Phil from Synity Gaming, and this is our We Are Synity Gaming video. Got anything to say, Phil? Sup? <laughs> well, um, right. anyway, basically, if you don't know who we are, we did a YouTube channel called Go Games or Go Games 100, whichever you, one you want to call it. Didn't wasn't very successful and we sort of neglected it a little bit during our exams but now we've finished all of our exams yes we are recording this on Friday the 14th of June hell yeah <laughs> we've finished all of our exams so now we have more time to spend on YouTube so we have created a new channel called Sinity Gaming and here is our intro Right, hope you like the intro, um, and basically we just want to talk a bit more about our channel. Uh, well, oh. where do we start? Uh. We like to think of ourselves as sort of an all-purpose entertainment gaming channel, or an all a one-stop gaming channel. So for like your gaming entertainment, game guides, uh, news, uh, whatever you fails. want. That sort of <laughs> that sort of entertainment. True. Um, so yeah, all sorts of stuff, all under one roof, which is our main aim. Not many channels we know do this, and there are there are also multiple people who are helping out with this channel, just like Go Games. Now these people include me, Connor, um, Peter, who is not here today, but yeah. we also have. Phil, who is here today, Hell and yeah. there is also the possibility of a fourth crew member, Hayden, but we don't know whether that's definite yet, and we didn't put him on the list. But anyway, um, my gaming history, well, not a lot to say. Probably not as lot as probably not as much as Phil. Uh, oh God, where do I start? Must have been about two thousand. I got a PS One. They were the console <laughs> then. They were the best around then, weren't they? Yeah, around 2000 is pretty good for a PS1. Well, PS1s came out in 1994. So yeah, but they didn't have many consoles coming out around then. Yeah, I suppose. Um, I started off with a PS1. Um, as I was saying to Hayden the other day, I think my very first game I completed was Monsters, Inc. Blim it out. Why? What was your first <laughs> game? I don't know. Um, so yeah, um, when I got a PS1, I sort of did... Like, uh, well, I sort of did realise my passion for video games. Um, and then a few years later, uh, I can't remember what year this was, it must have been about 2004, I got a PlayStation 2. I think it might have been 2004, it might have been. I, I don't know what year. I know it was. you definitely got a PlayStation 2. Um, I still have it now, it's in the box under my yeah. bed. It's in my old, it's in my Xbox 360s box. He got bed. rid of it, though. Did he? Yeah, I think he did. Well,. Uh, I've kept mine. Um, yeah, I started playing games like racing games and sort of more adventure type games. Um, I think it was 2006 or 7, I got a Nintendo DS. That was the. F Actually, no, I did get a PSP as well, but I didn't like that, which is what made me not buy a PlayStation 3. Um, in 2000 and whatever year, I'm not going to bother saying years because I don't know them all. Um, I got DS Lite, uh, really did like that. I had loads of games on there like, I don't know, Sim City, Worm, not Sim City, My Sims, um, Worms, oh god, what was the name of the game again? Worms, which one? The one on the DS, never mind. Um, the one we all play. Yeah, I can't, I can't remember what it was called, but yeah. I was yeah. sort of more just a casual gamer back then, but now, since I've had my Xbox 360, which I got in 2010, um, I have become more of a hardcore gamer, MLG. playing more games like Halo and stuff like that. Um, also, in 2008, I got a Wii console, really love that, don't play on it as much now, um, and I do still play my Xbox a lot. Uh, what games do I play on the Xbox? Well, Halo, Minecraft, some CODs, um, racing games, yeah, Assassin's Creed, like that. I don't that. play that too much now. But. No, but, yeah, I have played the first, for, uh, well, Assassin's Creed 1, 2, and Brotherhood. Um, 
Yeah, yeah I have got loads of games. I've got um, like Forza. I love that game. Uh, Trials Evolution. That is an awesome game. Yep. Um, I, remember our, I remember our very many battles mm. that we never tried to fight against Peter. <laughs> yeah, he's probably one of the best at Trials out of us. Uh, PC games. I don't play a lot of those, but I do. Don't have a game in PC, so yeah, I can't play the best games on PC. Um, but I think that's pretty much it for me. Um, um, Phil, what have you got to say? I have a lot of game. Well, I've gone through a load of consoles and stuff, but the main ones that I remember are I started with an original Xbox. Yep. And within the first five games I got, it was Halo. Which one? Halo 1? Yeah, original Halo. I still got it at home. Um, then I think I went from there to a GameCube. Weirdly enough. <laughs> Nintendo oh. GameCube. Um, played that a little bit. I never had a GameCube. Then I went to... In fact, I'd never actually heard of a GameCube until after I got the Wii. <laughs> Lol. I was that newbie at um, some games then. Uh, loads of other consoles in between, but I had a PS2, mm -hmm. Nintendo 64, I went back to into the past to get one of them. Bloody <laughs> hell. Then I eventually we got to the new age, and I got the 360. The new age. <laughs> the newer, like, <laughs> around this year, I got the 360. Yep. Originally arcade. I stupidly sold it. Don't you remember that? Really? Yeah, I accidentally sold it a wiki. Oh, yeah. right. And um, I eventually got a new one. Uh, you got an Elite, didn't you? I got an Elite, which was a 120 gigabyte hard drive. Yep. Yeah, then... Yeah, you're very, I kept you're on, very lucky now. Yeah, I kept on going with Xbox 360 since then. And now I've got the limited edition Halo 4 console with 320 gigabytes. Yeah, I'm really jealous about that. And I'm that. still in the 200 gigs free space. Um, now, I mainly play Xbox 360, but occasionally over holidays, I do go on Steam games on the computer, like Team Fortress 2, uh, Left 4 Dead 2, The Hidden... I do have a, like I have a Steam account, but I haven't brought anything on it yet. Really? No, I wanted to... I spent about 50, There was a few it. games on there that I wanted to get. I wanted to get Surgeon Simulator 2013. Because I've heard that's a really good game. I always want to get it, but it's more of a have fun with friends game than on your own. Yeah. Um, there are a few games on there I would get. Um, Peter's not here, but I'll give you a brief intro of what uh, he would say harvest. about his gaming history. Well, I've got a PS2. Yeah, I've played a lot of game on that. Uh, then I got a Wii, yeah, liked Wii Sports, got an Xbox 360, love zombies, done. That's pretty much what <laughs> Peter would have said if he was here. Over what he said in the whole thing. Pretty much. Um, right, what now? Anyway, videos. Um, our videos include a, re well, this one is a, a range. range of, but this is gaming news. We'll have um, some, we'll have a weekly news bulletin for you, which I'll explain a bit more in a minute. Uh, entertainment so I'll explain more about that as well and game guides and again I'll explain more about that for you too now one other thing about us as well we are not 18 yet so we can't play 18 or M rated games as you Americans call have them as so yeah unfortunately we, we can't play those but as soon as we're old enough we will start. yes as soon as I'm 18 cool I'll be hitting them um, but, as to our videos right now, uh, Sinity Gaming News, and as you can see there is a little button where you can click to go to the playlist. As this video is being recorded, all of the playlists will be empty because we haven't actually had, well, we haven't uploaded, actually, uploaded, we haven't any. uploaded any videos yet. This is the first one. Uh, so, Sinity Gaming News, or shortened as CGN, will be coming out on a Monday and it will be every week and it will be presented by me and Peter. Unless Peter's not in then it'll yes, be. Yes, then it will be Phil. Um, but that's only if he isn't. So there's our little logo for it there. Uh, basically we are going to be giving you in this bulletin information about uh, game releases um, and news that's happened in the past week. Uh, what else? Um, and also this Monday since E3 was just this week, or last week, or whenever you're watching this, um, 
Right, sorry about that, I got interrupted there. Um, anyway, um, back to this week's CGN. Um, this week was E3, so we'll be putting some things in it about that as well. Um, but other than that, that's really it at the moment uh, for Cinity Gaming News. Uh, game Guides. Um, yes. This is our little logo here. I really quickly made that yesterday, actually, and I do quite like it. Look at the trophy. That's yeah, okay. Um, okay, so this includes pretty much achievement guides and showcase. Now, achievement guides, obviously, you know what they are. Showcases. Yeah. We are deciding to do a showcase series where, say, for example, I don't know, a new game comes out that we want to show you, or I don't know, a new DLC or a new update, and we want to tell you about it. That's what showcase will be. It'll be showing you things in that new game, DLC or update, um, so you can decide whether to get it or not. Well, an update you'll have to get. Um, yep. Obviously these don't have uh, a set schedule. These will be completely random and we are only going to be doing videos for new games, not old ones. And also for achievement guys, we're going to try and not show you how to get really easy ones that you can just do by yourself. We're going to try and show you the ones that you need a little bit of skill for or you need to yeah. find stuff. So we're not going to just show you how to like, I don't know, say for uh, example Mario had achievement. We're not going to show you how to get an achievement to, I don't know, uh, find your first mushroom because that's so easy to get. Well, what about, um, well, this is what we would show you, Trials Evolution, find all the hidden squirrels. Stuff yeah, like something that. like that. Or I know we did Trials Evolution back on um, Go Games, and we did show you some really stupidly easy ones. Yeah. Um, so yeah, we're going to try not to show you the easy ones anymore. Uh, and also another game guide series we'll be doing is free online game of the week. This will be coming out on a Thursday, and it'll be every week. And Peter and Phil will be doing this. Basically, do you want to explain it, or haven't I told you enough? About uh, you told me a bit. It's basically we look on the internet for. A game that we think would be really good and we just play a little let's play of it like a small wow, video sort, wow it's got to be informative as well but yeah and basically peter and phil are just going to be playing uh an online game that's free um we'll be doing this every week as the title says um and yeah we'll always put a link to it in the description for you and as there you can click to see the playlist nothing in it at the moment but there will be soon uh, entertainment Let's Plays. These will be coming out Wednesday and possibly if we feel like it any other day in the week. But hopefully we'll try and get you one every Wednesday at least. Um, hopefully this will be weekly and presenters obviously random. Just see who mm. wants to play it or not or who's available. Um, the first Let's Play that's coming out this Wednesday is Worms. So check that out. Um, you definitely got to see that, um, and yeah, that's really it for the Let's Players. I'm fairly certain you all know what they are. It's just where we have a little bit of a laugh and play through a game. Uh, also, entertainment. Most of you, <laughs> if you watched Go Games back in the early oh, yes. days, you will remember Pete fails at Happy Wheels. Well, he is delighted to inform you that this is back. Um, this time, just under the name as Pete Fails. Um, it's going to be back on the same Tuesday slot. Uh, it's going to be weekly, and obviously, Pete Bell's Avrials is yeah. only going to be Peter presenting it. Um, what we're going to do is, with this one, we're going to split the year into about four, I think, which is about 13 or 14 weeks. So he's going to do the first 13 or 14 weeks playing Happy Wheels. Um, then we move on. Yeah, then we'll move game. on to a different game for the next 13 or 14 weeks, and then do the same over and over again. Haven't decided what the future games are going to be yet, but hopefully some hopefully we'll come up with some good ideas of what he's not very good at happy rules is one of those games he's terrible at um this one we don't really know which one to categorize it in because yeah. i wouldn't say it's a game guide but i wouldn't say it's entertainment either um basically me and phil are going to be doing a minecraft texture spotlight um this will be coming out on a monday uh same day as cgn uh it's also going to be weekly uh, and it's going to be presented by me and Phil. So uh, I've told Phil a little bit about this. Yep. Do you want to explain it or shall I? 
you can snare this time. Um, this one is basically we're going to download some Minecraft texture packs uh, and just basically show you them, show them what, show you what it's like, um, and see if we like it. Give an overall review on it and stuff like that. Um, I haven't mentioned anything else in this presentation, but if you um, watched Go Games, like I think within the last eight months or so, you'll probably remember that we did a weekly Let's Play on The Sims 3. Um, we are gonna, we are going to start this again. Uh, sorry, we never really finished it last time, yeah. but we are going to start fresh again. New neighbourhood. Um, haven't decided yet whether we're going to stick with the same Sims, um, but we will recreate them no matter what. Yeah. Um, that won't be coming out this week, but it will be starting shortly in a few weeks. Also, we have another Sims 3 thing that we're going to be doing, and I will explain more about that in a few weeks. Um, other than that, there's not really a lot more to say. Um, um, yeah, just thank you really for watching the video. Um, yep. And we hope that you do like our future videos. Um, at the moment, sort of still in like the growing phase. Well, this channel, not really, because we just started it. Um, but yeah, we've not got the best equipment ever. I'm sure when you mm. watch our Go Games videos, you might have seen that we only had like a free version of Bandicam and uh, really low quality game guide videos. But we have been trying to. We upgrade. have been upgrading our equipment gradually. We've got a new microphone with a windshield and a pop filter now. Um, we've also got sort of a HD capture card for Xbox games. Um, and we do also have the full version of Bandicam for PC gameplay, so you won't have the watermark at the top. And yeah, hopefully our videos will be better quality, not the best quality in the world, but better. Um, you got anything else you want to add, Phil? Uh, SimCity, are you doing anything on that yet? Don't know. We're trying to just think of stuff or plan stuff that we're doing in the near future. and. Well, we'll tell you more about new series that we are going to introduce in the future, not long before they come out. Um, I think that's really it. That's what I can think of. Um, by the way, this isn't the official launch of Cinity Game, and the official launch is on Monday the 17th of uh, June. Yeah. Oh, I forgot what month we're in. Um, <laughs> and ho I think the first video will be CGN. Either, yeah, it should be CGN. Um, so, yes. Uh, I don't know whether if Pete will be in that one because I know he's in school um, with an exam. Yeah. I don't know. He might I can't be remember. in school. Um, anyway, our, oh yeah, I did forget to mention our plans. Um, over the year, we do plan to try and get some sort of partnership with a network. Um, now, this should hopefully help us grow um, the channel. We don't really want it for the money at the moment. We just want it to help us grow and so that we can get all the awesome partner features um, so yes um, at the moment you won't see any advertisements on our videos um, but that might change hopefully in the future and well yeah hopefully this channel can be as successful as we dream it to be don't know whether that will happen though will it uh, it's always worth trying yeah never give up which is what we did on Go Games, but hey, we're starting again, fresh, try and get a new audience, better quality videos, just start again where we went wrong the last time. So mm -hmm. that is pretty much it, and I think we'll see you on Monday. So yeah, thank you for watching. You're going to say goodbye, Phil? See ya. And goodbye from me. Goodbye. <laughs>